Hi everyone. In today's lecture, we will discuss about assignment operator in Java. Fine. So, what is assignment operator? The assignment operator equal to is basically used to assign a value to a variable. Fine. For example, I have this int a is equal to 10. So, what is this a and what is this 10 and what is this equal to sign? Let's see that. Fine. So, this a is what? This a is a variable and this 10 is what? A value and this equal to is what? Assignment operator and what is happening behind the scene because of this line int a is equal to 10. See, a memory is allocated and the memory name is what a right and inside this what is going to be stored this 10 is going to be stored that is what if you will try to print this a uh, with the help of system dot out dot print l and a you will get 10 because now what happened because of this assignment operator this 10 value is assigned to or is stored to this a variable pretty much clear fine now let's see next another definition so this equal to is what a simple assignment operator which is basically used to assign right side operand or variable to left side variable. What does this means? Let me explain you by the help of example. So here we have directly stored the value 10 into a. But what if I will go through this approach? I have one variable in text is equal to 10 and what I am doing? I am writing int y is equal to x. This is also variable. This is also variable. So I am trying to assign this x to y but what happened internally what value x holds 10 right so at this point where int y is equal to x so y will become what after the assignment y will become what 10 whatever value present in the x will be assigned to y also because of this line int y is equal to x so what is this right side right hand side it is what a variable and what is the left hand side it is also a variable so so this variable is finally evaluated to a value 10 fine it means you are assigning a value to this y variable fine so most accurate or proper definition you can say is the first one only that the assignment operator is basically used to assign a value to a variable and in future we will see that we are going to store the function return value also into the variable fine we will see that part so when you will print this what you, what will be the output output will come like this 10 then dot 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 10 fine if you want to see this i can show you right away go to the eclipse you have com dot naveen package right click new then create a class class name what we can give what we are learning assignment operator so okay assignment operator demo you can give like this assignment operator simple i want a main method in this also finish now let's see what was the code int a is equal to 10 fine what was the code x okay referring x int x is equal to 10 and int y is equal to x system dot out dot print ln what x three dots plus y this i am trying to do right so right click run as java application see you got the output 10 three dots then 10 three dots are uh, basically i am using to separate the values nothing much okay so this is the output fine next now 
we have compound assignment operators also now what is compound assignment operator c sometimes assignment operator is blended with some other operators and that type of assignment operators are known as compound assignment operators sometimes what is the case you are going to combine the assignment operators with some another operators and that final operator that combination of operator is called as compound assignment operator fine uh, so i will cover one one compound assignment operator and i will give you the you know you can understand the flow by the help of one and i will give you the summary of others fine so the first one is plus equal to operator so this operator is a compound of plus and equal equal means what assignment operator so this is a combination of plus operator and and equal means assignment operator is it clear let's see the syntax syntax is like this a plus equal to b fine and what is the equivalent expression equivalent expression is a is equal to a plus b fine. for example i have this int a is equal to 5 then i have written a plus equal to 25 then system dot out dot print ln a tell me what will be the output what will happen at this line see what will happen what is the equivalent expression a is equal to a plus b so here what is present 25 is present so a is equal to a plus 25 now tell me what is the value of this a a is what 5 5 so 5 plus 25 so the final a will be what 30 so in the output you will get 30 as the output here first this this will resolve then assignment will take place remember this point okay now let's see this in what in eclipse go to the eclipse what you want to do you have what int a is equal to int a is equal to 5 right 5 and then a plus is equal to 25 this then you are trying to print this sister out dot print ln now i am trying to print a right click run as java application see the output is what 30 same same i explained right the output is what 30 and how it become 30 by using this logic pretty much clear so this is the one compound assignment operators like this we have total 11 so this all 11 i have specify here this is what plus equal to this is what minus equal to this is what multiplication equal to this is what a combination of division operator and assignment operator this is what a combination of modulo operator and assignment operator this is what a combination of bitwise and operator and assignment operator this is what a combination of bitwise or operator and equal and assignment operator this is what a combination of bitwise exclusive or operator and assignment operator this is what the combination of what is this this is basically a combination of right shift operator and assignment operator and this is what a combination of unsigned right shift operator and assignment operator and this is what the combination of left shift operator and assignment operator and i have given few examples and their equivalent expressions also so you can go through this total we have this how many 11 11 compound assignment operators you can go through this and if you have any doubt in this you can reach out to me so thanks for watching this video please subscribe our youtube channel to get the further updates